guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to the final episode of Senior Girl. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Let's see if they finally confess to one another. Oh, they're together. Ian is big behind Melon Blood, I believe. Oh. <clears throat> Do you have anything to share? It's okay. She gets them. Oh my god! Mm -hmm.
Because the look on your face says everything. <laughs> Did you like them? That's so sweet. Mm hmm.
Really? You know what? I'm fine that they did not confess to each other. In a way, they did. That's okay. I accept it. It was a really good show, honestly. For a show that was only really 12 minutes, as I've said with other shows that I've watched in the past that have been like at least 10, 12 to 15 minutes long, it was really good. I, I hate the fact that, you know, because some of them that I've watched have been 12 to 13 episodes. Some have been less than that. But it did a really good story in a certain amount of episodes. I mean, especially with the fact it was only like 12 minutes. Most shows, they have to take a little bit longer to do it, which is like 24 to maybe even an hour to do it, and that's okay. I, I think it was a really good story. AG and Nanako, they're really cute together, and I love them. It's just, it makes me wonder, like, possibly in the manga, they could possibly confess to each other, but, you know, we'll never know. I'll never know if I ever have time to read it, but it was a really good series. I just kind of wish that everyone was in this episode, but I just do also love the fact that it focused on these two as a whole, because no matter what, it always came back to them. They were the ones who technically started the series, and yeah, but still, it would have been nice to have everybody just hang out one last time, but because this is the last episode, they really can't do it, and it makes me wonder, like, if it could have possibly happened OVA, I don't think it could because I think either my anime list or like someone would have had it by now. But yeah, it was a cute little story. I loved it. I think the poems for every single week was interesting. AG has a really interesting vocabulary of how he writes his versus Nanako because Nanako, she's just, she's adorable and hers are always cute. AGs are like, I don't know. AGs are different. That's his. He's different, and that's what he is. I mean, you know, this was a dude who was starting out fighting all the time, and in the end, he's a really nice, kind, gentle dude, and he's just, mm, I like him a lot, and it's just upsetting to the fact that this is the last episode, and I kind of wish there was more. I wish it could go on for, like, 24, 12 more episodes, and just end, and then have it end with him confessing, but... It was a really good series, and I would recommend this to, like, my boyfriend or maybe one of my friends if they ever needed something to watch, like, in under a couple of hours, like, if you could finish it in a day. But if you wanted to really take your time with it, then yeah. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards the series, Send Me a Girl. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad, and of course, I will see you guys all next time. Bye, guys.